Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Castle Bat. Uh, we are in Kingdom number 5. Okay. Uh, well, so the this video we are going to focus on how we can stop these uh, T12 cavalries. I mean, I know it's difficult to, I mean, these T12 cavalries, uh, people are doing solo hits, they are killing uh, all of us, right? So, is there a way, is there a formation by which uh, we can actually stop these uh, T12 cavalries? So we tried some uh, some battles last night, and uh, uh, we'll show you the reports. But uh, what was done is this is not. I mean, this this battle was on a plot fight, so it's not actually uh, the same result you will see on a castle or on a throne. But but still, I mean, we'll try those battles also and share the report. But this is one you can you can see that, that this is take one for. Uh, Trial one of stopping these T12 cavalries, and we'll give we'll get uh, you more uh, such battles. So what we did was there are two uh, different players used uh, against uh, my uh, troops. So both of those two players were asked to use T12 cavalries and T12 infantries. That was the formation they were using uh, in most of the times, and then uh, also what what was asked is I mean the first player has around seven hundred. T12 calves, he has good damage, uh, the health is okay, like 200, but it's not like very high, right? The second player has uh, like 820 uh, cavalry attack, really high damage and all, health is also good. So he's like a player who will get to 900 plus easily in KVK, so it's good. So they are two kind of players and we'll see what could actually stop, the, stop their T12 cavalries or we could not. So let's go into the battles now. So starting with, uh, so again, it's a plot fight. We tried, started with 3,000 troops. Then we start, We went to 5,000 troops. Uh, hero was allowed. You can use dragons. You can use heroes. Uh, as you can see here, his stats are like close to 690. Health is okay. Uh, damage is 100. I think he changed that across time. But... Uh, uh, We'll see his stats again. I think he's chained later. This was 3,000 T12 uh, cavalries against my uh, 3,000 T13 infantry. Uh, not a not a good match. I mean, not a good uh, report to show because my enhancements are not done. And But still, uh, uh, I mean, in general, we cannot enhance everything, right? So we have to find out a way by which if we don't have the enhancements done and we are working, still are working on it. Is there a way to stop these guys, right? And he has some enhancement done at, uh, at least. All right, so, well, uh, that's one. Let's keep moving. So, hmm. uh, right. Here, uh, what did he send? Okay, so this was, again, he was sending out uh, uh, T. I think T11 siege. Ignore this report. We are not uh, talking about. We are talking about only the the opponent having T12 infantry and T12 cavalry, right? So see this report. Brutal. He killed us. <laughs> he killed us bad. And his stats have changed here now. Six around 700 uh, cavalry, 213 health, and the damage has increased. He's changed his stats now. So uh, if you can see the cavalry, T12 cavalry, they doing that their game, right? 10 wounded, 4,722 killed. Wow. What did we use? We used uh, T12 Siege, a bad idea. Uh, maybe good idea if you have enhancements done, but well, we can't enhance everything, right? We will go uh, bit by bit on it. So this doesn't work, uh, at least with these enhancements. Let's keep moving. All right, with this, we get a bit better result. 14, 41,000 versus 17,000. What was changed? So we asked him to stick with his formation. So that's okay. But we changed. We brought in some T12 infantries. We brought in some T10 calves. T10 calves did some damage, 2,000 kills. They are not fully enhanced, as you can see, but they still did some. So I'm, I'm, I'm happy to see that, actually, the T10 calf doing some damage here. But let's keep going. Let's see what else we could do. Now, keep moving on. We saw a similar kind of report. Uh, maybe a bit better. 
his formation is same our formation was including these t9 pikes now these pikes are uh, basically they are enhanced on on one level that spike enhancement has been done they did not do that ma uh, that damage i have seen them doing good damage if you have tons of those in the ca in the castle and you're defending so they have killed more than what they die for sure but look at these uh, t10 cavalrys hmm. they're doing their job right kind of they are still killing the t12 cavalry they're dying more but i but still right the uh, one troop to note i believe now keep going up in the second battles uh, i think we saw this one yeah okay this one see this gave me a lot of hope that means again the formation of the attacker is same and his uh, his uh, uh, troop types are same i see his stars going a bit i don't know what he did 675 arch uh, cavalry attack uh, we'll see but still uh, here i see no infantry were used we used t10 and t11 cavalries and t11 cavalries uh, again are different troop types which perform well against t12 and uh, uh, t10 cavalry also doing not not that bad right so i'm going to see more and show you a success report now so we got the first win against a t12 cavalry and t12 infantry see this one so t12 cavalry they were they were defeated with this formation 1000 t10 infantry uh, 1000 t10 cavalry and around 3000 uh, t10 uh, t11 cavalry we got a win we got a win here right we are not having t12 cavalry let's say we are not in log unlocked any of the t12 we do have t11 and we have t10 cavs we could win this so if you have good stats of cavalry seems like cavalry uh, of these kinds can kill the t12 cavalry which are expensive right i know t11 is expensive also but not that and i mean if you not unlocked it so okay so that's one then i think he tried to increase his infantry and still i mean it's not like a big loss it's still a balanced report i would say right and his stats are uh, back and what happened with the earlier stats in the victory let's quickly see 697 so it was same thing right so we got a win with his stats whatever he has stats right now the only thing that he did here was he had to increase increase his t12 infantries now of course i mean if we try the same battles with with the opponent trying to put in some t10 infantries also we'll see some variations in this uh, result uh, and we will try that out also sooner this is a take one uh, the first video about it uh, as you can see here the t10 cavalry lost their battle they did what 2000 kills last time and now they are down and uh, t11 cavalry i mean they are doing good they they are they are doing very good against the t12 cavalry i'm very very happy with them okay now uh, with that done i think that was the last battle with him uh, no this was one more so what was used here okay this was all ca t10 uh, t12 cavalry against all t11 cavalry right so see the difference and the, the report is 41000 so not murdered but yeah they were not they they were not as powerful as t12 cavalry i got it but then they are not as weak also that they guess get butchered right so still okay uh now with that this guy was done and we moved on to the second player now the second player has really good stats of cavalry 820 cavalry defense is high damage dealt is high health is okay side but uh, on the okay side but uh, charge damage 134 really good crit damage is 80 there is no crit chance so we got to have crit chance also anyhow so with that what we tried was the same uh, formation that was that got us a victory to see what happens against a brutal player like him or a good stats player like him i mean he will reach 900 easily during kvk right so this is on all non kvk battles 
that happened last night. So here you see uh, 1000, so same formation that was always asked for the opponent. opponent. We use, we stick to the same formation like 1000 T10 infantry, 1000 T10 cavalry and 3000 T11 cavalry. So they did okay. So see T11 cavalry are still doing, um, they are not getting murdered. They are still doing uh, some damage to these T12 cavalries. And T10 cavalry, I'm still not unhappy with that, right? With this report. It's a brutal player and you are trying with no T12s around it. You are, yeah, you're not winning it. It's not a close battle, but still it's uh, it's okay. It's okay to see uh, what they can do. Now here, what happened here? I think the opponent has same formations. If I, yes. What did we change? So I think we brought in some archers, T12 archers. They're not fully enhanced, I get it. But, uh, well, uh, nothing much changed with them. But what did change is this. So here's a report which uh, killed, which did very good against T12 cavalry, right? Against a very strong player. Um, so same formation of opponent. For us, we were using some pikes, T9 uh, pikes. And then we brought in T13 uh, cavalries. They, they slaughtered the T12 cavalry, right? Expected, but had to be checked that what is happening around here. So if you have not unlocked T12, you want to beat a strong T12 uh, player of cavalry. T13 may be the way to go. If you want to beat a average player around cavalry and he has T12, you have not unlocked T12. The earlier formation of our using T11 with T10 calves will, will kill them. Right, so that's uh, good to know. Then I think he went with uh, he wanted to try out the uh, same formation as us. That's that report is not very useful because I mean, then it all about stats and all, nothing different. So I think we in this video we're talking about formations. So what formation will beat what, right? So that's one thing. Now, one more uh, stuff that we tried we tried uh, some attacks on food. So we were defend. Uh, we were defending. They were attacking again uh, in their fort. So uh, as you can see, uh, we tried the first one with Salma, and how much kill we got? So two point one against one point one million. Okay. Uh, so the attacker has T thirteen cav, T twelve cav. We have like T nine pikes. A lot of them. So it seems like the pikes alone. Uh, not doing unless they are like tons of those either we have tried to fight in palace with uh, with these formations and also in the castle i think they have done much better than what i'm seeing the report here so i'll still say uh keep enhancing your t9 pikes and have tons of those in the castle i don't deny that because when we defending the defended the 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 castle uh rally from tvb and those guys i've seen t9 still did good T10 archers got murdered and we got defeated. Uh, that was one one reason apart from TVB being the uh, so brutal alliance, right? But yeah, but in this one to one fights, uh, it's get difficult with just these formations. Okay, and uh, there was one more here. So this one was infantry hero, same formation of attacker, but uh, infantry hero didn't do well. See. Because you don't have the crit da chance, the crit damage and all. So, again, just having high HP, high attack, high defense, but not having the crit damage and the damage, not going to work out. Balancing stuff all over the uh, place is, is what is needed. It, it is clearly visible here. Right? Half the kills you get. See? Okay. Well, uh, ho hopefully these videos are helping, helping you all out. Uh, uh, we like to hear feedback. If you have tried some other formations and if you have reports, send it, send it out to us and we will definitely show that in this channel. If you want us to try some more formations, we'll try it out. Uh, one thing that I do want to try is uh, try those T13 archers and see what they do against these cavalries. So we'll make those videos soon. But uh, uh, send us comments, uh, send us some suggestions. Please do uh, subscribe, share and uh, and keep enjoying the game. Thank you so much.